Hello everyone, I hope you're doing well, and in this video I will be talking about Beowulf, and give you my thoughts about it. I hope you enjoy, or at least find this video informative. But first a thank you to Page Unknown for the topic of this video. Now everyone, if you have any suggestions for videos on topics and people that you find interesting, don't hesitate to give them to me in the comment section down below, and I'll make them into a video for you. Now, Beowulf is an old English epic poem set in the 6th century in Scandinavia, modern-day Denmark, Norway, Sweden, and Finland, written in either the late 10th or early 11th century based upon the age of the original manuscript. It tells the story of Beowulf, who would slay the monster Grendel, the monster's mother, and in later life, a great dragon that threatened his homeland at the cost of his own life. Aiding Hrothgar against Grendel and later against Grendel's mother, who both attack the Mead Hall of the King of Danes. Now, in my view, the story of Beowulf is three equally great stories put together to explore the great trials of Beowulf to face a ravenous beast, then the vengeance-filled demon that birthed the ravenous beast, both vanquished after periods of great struggle. Then decades of peace, in which Beowulf becomes king of his land, only to fall after giving his all to slay the dragon. Aided by the most courageous of his men, Wiglaf, ending as the people pay respects to their warrior king by burning him, and building a barrow, also known as a tomb, which would be visible from the sea. Beowulf is a truly riveting story, in my view, that has rightfully stood the test of time. I highly recommend this story, and hope it inspires you to craft your own stories, using this story as a model for your own. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you very much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Suggestions for videos are welcome in the comment section down below. If you are subscribed, don't forget to hit that notification bell and check you're still subscribed, because YouTube likes keeping smaller content creators down while aiding the dying establishment and their mainstream media allies. My name is Ryan Roger Athe, and I wish you all a great day. Until next time, folks, bye for now.